Hello and welcome to episode 107 of my Two Worlds tutorial Let's Play series. Um, I'm currently mapping out the Drakkar Desert, which you can see here, and I want to carry on doing that to remove the fog from here and see if there's any hidden caves or dungeons. Most certainly there is this encampment, which is either Varn or God Orcs, and there's this up here, but Let's see if I can clear all the fog from here. And we are working our way to the breach in an ever so slowly fashion. I want to map out all of this fog. So let's carry on. Oh, and I've got some farm to kill first. Behold. That's what you get. Let's have a look. Oh, look at that. An actual upgrade for my armor. It's a shame it didn't have any, I think, additional, but never mind, I'm not going to grumble. Nice. Makes me that little bit stronger. Oh, and a chest. Oh, permanent effect. Definitely have that. Yeah, so that's all we want from there. Yeah, it's quite a big desert, this. Ooh, lots of farm and a shaman, so I have to be careful of their casters. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, they're blasting me. Now that was lovely. Always like gaining levels. What level am I? Let's have a look. Level 66, so I'm just saving up some points now. I'm going to spend them eventually before the breach. Not sure though what uh, I want to spend them on. Let's keep going. It's always lovely though to gain a level. Get that bit tougher. I don't know what they were doing hanging out here under a few palm trees. Oh, they've got a chest there. Nice. What is that sulfur on the ground? Archmage Necro Staff. Now, is that the one I need? I'm not sure. Let's take it. But there is a quest. And I'm not going to worry about what is hidden in here somewhere for a Necromancer Staff. So I'll just take that. Oh, Sulfur lying on the ground. Yeah. Might be the staff I need, might not. I'll just sell it if it isn't. But it's nice to tie up the little side quests if I can. Finish them. Ooh, glare. Dragon, nice. 
Where is the dragon? Here somewhere. As long as he don't jump out on me. Oh, there he is. They're so pathetic. Actually, I have great respect for the dragons. They dropped some nice loot. Oh, what's that tucked away? Is that a teleport? I think it is. Let's map this bit out. Oh, another dragon. Nice. Oh yeah, this is like the land of the dragons. Excellent. Um, because they give, I think it's 50 to your resistances with the item they have. Ooh. right behind me. Stalking me. Have a dragon. Ha. That's interesting. So there's a teleport tucked away, hidden in the trees. Oh. More dragons. Come 
uncomfortable customers. Oh, and more dragon. This is beautiful. Um, just to show, I know I've shown previously, but this is what the dragons drop. So increases physical protection by 15. It's permanent effect, so you can make your own um, potions with giving that effect. You can see I've made some here, which I really ought to just drink all of these. I don't know why I'm wasting space in my pocket. Um, I don't know, I guess I'm saving them for emergencies, but I really ought to drink them because I've got to make a ton of them. I can make loads. Pathetic. Ooh. Yeah, I always love seeing dragons. Deep for me to get up that bit. Let's try around here. Scorpions, by the looks of it. No caves yet, or dungeons. Lots of on. There's a magic source. What do we have here? checking though because you never know you might get an upgrade for armor or your weapon oh another barn camp prefer to get the shaman first ha huh. Still with me. Not really doing a lot of damage though, to be honest. To me. <laughs> Cue hysterical laugh. Aha. Ooh, that's a lot of spells. Damage booster. They got some nice stuff on them. Nice loot. Let's have a look. Even their chests are brimming with goodies. No, it's only temporary. Temporary. Start.
Now, I wonder if there's anything tucked into that valley ahead. Oh, yeah, another barn camp. dealt with them. No. No, I won't bother with that. Formed stave. Not worth having, though. No? Oh, nice big chest for me to loot. Couple of chests, looks like. speed minus 50 no way right so that's what was tucked away in this valley Mr. Shaman, let's get in first. What's that? Damage booster. Nice. Ooh, Cyclops. I thought I could see something out there. They're just so huge. I wonder if he'd one hit kill me. Looks like another Cyclops. <laughs> Still no sign of a cave. There's another alcove over there.
Well, we're getting the Drakkar Desert mapped out. What's that? Mm, I'm not sure I want to go down there yet. I can carry on with the desert here, I think. Oops, what am I doing? Press the wrong key. There you go, buy myself a bit of time. They didn't do much damage though. Busy kicking dirt in my face. <coughs> yeah, they're, they're, they're not hitting me hard now. Uh, that's all good. I don't know where they come from though. They just spawned on top of me. Don't seem to have a great deal loot wise. That interests me, that is. Now, uh, okay, I see a load more over here. Yeah. Get that shame first. <laughs> Mm. 
Ooh, scorpions. Just spawned. Who's that? Any shame in there. What's there? Die. Let's see. Oh, look like a bone. Lord of the Bones. <laughs> yeah, it's not very good damage, though. I hardly call it the Lord of the Bands. Oh, Oldemore's Hut. Let's go explore Oldemore's Hut. Ooh, who's this? Harry Oldemore. Now, I don't know if he's hostile or not. So. Let's go say hello, see if he attacks me. No, he's not attacking. Let's talk to him. Oh, it's a quest. Harry Oldemore. Welcome, traveller. Well met. Who are you, then? I am known as the Dragon Whisperer, but my real name is Harry Oldemore. So, you talk to dragons, do you? Indeed. I am the keeper of the last dragons in Drakkar. But an albino dragon called the Great White One steals their eggs and controls them thus. Interesting. And is there no way to act against this albino? Aye, his power can be broken. If the other dragons can recover their eggs, they can then attack him without fear. Hmm. I will search for the eggs. Do you know where I can find them? Nay, no one knows where the albino's nest is. However, he himself comes from the mountain range in southern Drakkar. Mayhap that may be a start for you. Hmm, not much help, but I will do what I can. I sense you are the right man for this task. Find his nest and return to me. Then I will send the other dragons to recover their eggs. Dragons can be several hundred years old, but they only lay one egg in all that time. Oh, yes, so if not. one egg is destroyed... And the albino uses the eggs to do whatever he wishes? Aye, the Great White One has enormous power over the remaining dragons. This power will be broken if the dragons get their eggs back. The Great White One was just a normal member of his species at first. But when he reached adulthood, he turned... bad. What did the others do? When he killed one of the others, they banished him and trimmed his wings to weaken him. He vanished to the south and swore to get revenge. Aye, he got his revenge, methinks. But how did he achieve this? The dragons keep their eggs in nests high in the mountains. No one can reach them because of the thin air and poison gases. But the albino knew all this. And then? He used the power of a rare magic crystal to create some jackals who were able to climb the peaks and steal the eggs. Then his reign of terror started. A rare magic crystal? That interests me. Pray tell me more. It is only a rumor, but is supposed to be part of an extremely powerful artifact. The albino swallowed this crystal to gain part of its power. This gift was handed down to me from my father. 
In their golden era, dragons could be found all over Antelor. And dragon whisperers were the go-betweens for dragons and humans. And you contact them just by thoughts? Aye. A kind of trance state. They know immediately when my soul opens their thoughts. Farewell, mercenary. Okay, so, <clears throat> got a new quest. The Dragon Whisperer. Quest solved. Oh, is it solved? Let's talk to him again. Oh. Have you found the stolen eggs? Aye, I found them. I will show you the location on my map. Oh. Well done, stranger. Great. I will contact my dragon friends now. They will dethrone the Great White One. Methinks this is a spectacle indeed. Where will they attack? I believe they will attack him at the ruins of the Dragon's Lair in the southwest. Make haste. Twill be a spectacle indeed. Okay. Farewell. Farewell, mercenary. Right, cool. Well, we've got some experience for that. Uh, if we look at the map... He's talking about the dragon's lair just there. Um, in the next episode, because the time has gone, we can pop down there and have a look. Uh, I'm about, I better end it here because the timer has gone. But uh, we're going to check it out in amongst in amongst my exploring. I need to still do this area, but it looks like I've nearly done most of the Drakkar Desert now. Alright, well I've still got that to do. Anyway, wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.